Welcome to 60 Second Civics, the daily podcast of the Center for Civic Education. I'm Mark Gage. We are joined today once again by Hernan Sanchez, Coordinator of National Programs for the Center for Civic Education. Welcome, Hernan. Can you define for us how Hispanic cultures enrich the United States? So many people actually use the term Latino and Hispanic interchangeably, but they do mean different things. So starting off with just the terminology, Latino or Latina refers to people who are descendants of Latin America. Technically, Latino applies to all people in the American continent who speak Romance languages that come from Latin America or Latin, such as Spanish, Portuguese, and French. Meanwhile, Hispanics are those who speak Spanish or are descendants of Spanish speakers. As an example, both of my Mexican parents are Hispanic and Latino because they are Spanish speaking and they were born in Latin America. However, my Brazilian friends are not Hispanic because they speak Portuguese rather than Spanish, but they are considered Latino because they are from Latin America. And then just the the Hispanic culture has enriched the United States in many ways, and it has become more evident in the past few years. One of the greatest Hispanic influences on the United States, it's most definitely the food. Tacos, guacamole, and other corn and salsa-based snacks and dishes are not super popular here in the States. Uh, We have also enriched the U.S. with our music, uh, such as reggaeton, sports such as soccer. And then we also see the influence through TV, social media, fashion, language, and then traditions such as Cinco de Mayo and also Dia de los Muertos, or better known as Day of the Dead. And then lastly, Hispanic influence is also seen in American culture and politics. And then they have become more palpable in the last decade. So prominent politicians like Marco Rubio and Alexandra Ocasio-Cortez are huge influencers. Well, thank you so much, Hernan. That's all for today's episode, 60 Second Civics, where civic education only takes a minute.